I've actually never seen milk in my house like this before. I swear we usually have it in the containers, but I guess there wasn't enough, so it was just transferred to this. But I was like hoping for it to be like a really aesthetic intro and like me put the milk container down. And nope, this is what I got. Cereal first, always. You know, in the summer, I turn pretty how Belly always has like a jar of milk just like on the counter ready to pour. I felt like one of those aesthetic families having it in a jar fest, but cheers. Let's go eat. I am trying to consume as much social media as I possibly can now before I go on a ship for four months. So in the morning, I usually check up on TikTok and Instagram, sometimes Twitter. So this is me doing that. But while you're at it, follow me on Instagram to see all the cool content I'll be posting. I also got an email that my application to University of Florida was submitted. So yay. The next part of the day, I force my dog to cuddle with me. Willie. Willie, come on. I force him to cuddle with me. He usually likes it, I swear, and we sit like this for like 30 minutes to an hour. That's what my life has been consisting of because he's so old and I'm leaving him for four months. So spend all the time with him. But look at cutie. I know there's gonna be a lot of comments, Montage, like white mm -hmm. crusty dog, you know, but keep that to yourself because I think he's beautiful. Oh, yeah. I am on my way to go get a haircut. I got my extensions out in May and my hair has been growing ever since. And honestly, it's like really nice. I like it a lot and it's like been curly and wavy or wavy more so. And I like it a lot, but because I'm gonna go on a ship for four months, I should just get a little trim, even though I just got one two months ago, but that is healthy hair care. So I'm gonna go and just get like a half an inch off. Not a lot, I don't want a lot because it is short still no angles no layers nothing i'm super duper basic and easy with my haircut so let's go get one i got and i'll show you my haircut um i think i like it a lot and i like the way that she like blow dried it and stuff it looks really nice but i went and got it cut at a place called studio 43 in cranberry which is a really cute town next to the town that i live in i used to go here a lot to get my prom like hairdos and stuff but i like always have such a difficult time finding hair places in new jersey i don't know why it's so difficult no one ever gets what i'm asking like if i ask to get like silvery highlights and stuff it's always like yellow the haircuts are always like botched like once i went to a place and i was like hi can i get like an inch off i no joke like this was the laughing stock of my senior year got a bob haircut like the lady cut off at least seven inches and it was horrific so that was not a good experience and i love my hair places in san diego but i'm not there right now so this place called studio 43 always did a really good job with my prom hairstyle so i just went and got a blow and a haircut and it looks really nice and i like it a lot and it's a cute little town i'll show you look it's just like a really cute downtown area with like all these shops and little homes on the main street and the homes are all like adorable so i love this town Currently I'm doing some community service and I'm helping my mother figure out how to get different currencies for semester at sea and for our trip beforehand. So I just got 30 minutes of community service helping the elderly and yet even with my age, she's having difficulty. Anything you'd like to say? Any yeah, this, thank you for helping? This bank sucks. Mom, what if they wanna like give me like a collab one day <laughs> if you're talking shit i love you bank of america down to the app subscribe <laughs> all right i'm going on a walk now though i want to get a whole cut out of my vagina <laughs> i was joking i was totally joking going to the guy now <laughs> same thing basically women's health important i went on a walk for probably what do you think the distance of the neighborhood day farm that neighborhood day farm is I walked for an hour, so that's probably like, yeah, yeah three miles. Went on a three mile walk, showered so that I don't smell it, and then afterwards we will be packing. Um, but the Dutch people certainly, you know, it's uh, yeah. many, many locals will speak actually all of these languages. On my way to the gyno, I listened to this semester at sea webinar that I forgot we had that just had a bunch of informational things. Go work hard. I will. You got it. I am supposed to be walking a dog right now. Usually I do it twice a day in the morning and in the evening, but my mom's done it for me today because in the morning I was really, really tired and I needed to sleep in. Love you, Patty. You're the greatest. And then right now I just got like the most painful procedure thing and I just need to chill. I'm in pain. So I'm at home while my mom's walking the dog, but I... 
I have some cool things that I want to show you guys. I found my really old Canon camera. This bad boy is from a long time ago, but I needed on Amazon to buy adapting cords to it because I haven't used them forever, so I didn't have cords anymore that like went into my laptop to get the footage off of it. So I just got two from Amazon seeing if they work. This one did. But what I love about this camera is like how it does give it a little like vintage look. You can't really see it that way, but I'm gonna insert a clip of what the recordings on it look like. Okay, this is the footage on this camera. I love it. It's so cool. Like look, just chilling with my dog. House tour, woo. I love this camera, it's so cute. I think I want the photos on it. This is all from like an old trip. I hate how you can't see a screen. With my friends when we went to Utah. I don't know, it gives like a funny film kind of look. So I'm excited to bring this with me at semester at sea. So I'm just making sure that these cords work. And then honestly, sitting with my dog watching TV, I'm gonna start editing this video even though I'm still filming my day and what I'm doing. I think I'm just gonna like start editing it because it goes chronologically anyways. So I'm gonna start doing it. The doctor was like, you should just like lay in bed the rest of the day. And I was like, yeah, I totally should girly. And I got froyo and that always makes me happy. So I'm gonna go edit. I also got a new laptop because my old laptop didn't have enough storage space and this bad boy is a tank. It has two terabytes which is perfect for video editing and just all the videos and photos that I take but I will be backing it up all also because I know how important that is but I got a new laptop case that fit this laptop and I stickered it the other day so I wanted to show you guys it. It's really cute. I love stickering things. It just adds like color and inspiration and I think it's really cute. So I have a little Billabong one. Stuff is just stuff which is Sunbum, one of my favorite brands. I just love their brand marketing and their products. So I have two little Sunbum things, Better Together, which is a Bumble sticker. Get Soaked, this was from Black Bow Bathing Suit Company. That is gnarly. Y'all, I say it all the time, even though I'm not from the South. San Diego, live, love, laugh, love it. Self Love Club, so important. The Loft was one of my favorite like ski stores up in the Poconos where I used to go skiing for like my whole entire life. Coachella, I will be going every single year until I die, since I went after this first year. Like For Good People is another Bumble stick sticker in and out mm, miss it everything happens for a reason i believe in that honey go lucky is bumble thanks for the memories it was a museum in dallas the memory museum i think it's called new york love it this was a little like brandy melville sticker that i've had for like 10 years love yourself so important here today going to vacay they'll surfboard don't surf love the vibe the aesthetic stsu and then this sticker is me in a sticker stsu i loved it best four years of my life life is good i've had this in my instagram bio for like 10 years now and then do what you love love what you do is just another quote that i like fucking fuck with but this is my new laptop stickering and I love it. And then I also got this soft case because on the ship with your laptop, you can't have it on a hard surface like that or else it will break. Do you guys like my justice gift cards, by the way? Found those bad boys. But it will break the thing, so you need to always have it on a soft case like that. So I got that as well. Another thing that I got for semester at sea, as you see, I'm editing my video in the background right now, is this camera protective case for my Canon G7X Mark II. I saw this on Amazon and I was like, this is perfect because I drop my camera a lot and hopefully this will help protect it. And it just makes it look cute. So I got this on Amazon for like $16. For dinner, I already ate. Oh, is there none left? Yeah. Oh. Well, sorry guys. I ate all of the mac and cheese and that's what I had for dinner was just a big bowl of mac and cheese. So can't show that to you. Right, Willie, we ate all the mac and cheese. Literally just asked me what game I want to start off with and then said no. <laughs> the Summer Olympics? Do you feel like you'll give a better performance in the Summer Games than your horrific performance yesterday? Yes, I'm more suited for that. Were you disappointed in your performance at the Olympics no, yesterday? not really. I'm you did not. I'm a little out you, of shape. You got on the scoreboard once, Mom. Um, I was and you're not disappointed? Shape. No, no. For my age, I think I did well. Choosing a character in itself is a sport because, you know, it's all about speed, who gets the good characters first. It's all about skill, you know, like your choice of who you pick. We do it right now. <laughs> your mom.
almost had it. Go, go, mom. Go. <laughs> I don't want to do this one. <laughs> didn't look any better than gymnastics. Yeah, I, I just beat the world record. Yeah, yeah. No, no. oh no. Oh, what? No, I didn't. No, I, I, we lied. <laughs> Mario and I are looking quite alike. It's because we're the same person. Winners only. It's gonna be winner. Yeah! yeah I got three points. You got three points before for that. Uh, Uno in slow mo time. Let's go. Painting <laughs> problem. I stole this shirt from my dad's closet. It's my bedtime shirt now, but it's like cute and nice and like oversized. If it was longer, it could be a really, really cute dress. But of course, it's not long enough on me. That's it for today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to Europe soon, so that will be a ton of Europe fun travel content. And then Africa and Asia as well. So it's going to be super, 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 super. Fun. But yeah, I watched Love Island tonight and now I am going to lay in bed and edit this and wake up early tomorrow. So with that being said, good night. Hope you guys had a great day and bye. Song.